Hey guys, HW. It's Friday in Sydney and I've got a few matters to attend to in the city today so I thought I'd whack on the camera now as I stare down Druitt Street towards the new W Hotel in the background there at Darling Harbour immediately across the road from the back of Town Hall here in Druitt Street but as I came past I thought I might start the vid here on Market Row I pointed down this sketchy alleyway when I was at that uh, coffee shop the other week um, Chinatown Country Club so let's get down this sketchy old alley entrance to a to a massage joint there I wonder if I can get down that uh, that other way down there as well. I don't think so. I don't think there's a through way there. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's go down there and have a look anyway. There's the Chinatown Country Club. So yeah, let's see what's at the end of this alley or what we like to call in Australia a laneway. Oh look at this old building. It's got the American style uh, fire escapes. The uh, the ladders slide down some nice ferns on the back there yeah I didn't think there was a way through you could probably get through one of the buildings if you knew how to get into the fire escape Don't know what that buzzing is. So alert the HW's presence. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna have to have a stop along the way. I wanted to pick something up from the shops and maybe get something to eat as well. on York Street now outside uh, Queen Victoria building might take a shortcut through the QVB now haven't got the Christmas tree up yet The dome at the bottom, oh, up at the top. Let me get over to this sporting store. Just looking for, I'm trying to find like a band for my uh, uh, wrist. My watch broke and I feel naked not having a band on my arm so I'd be happy just with one of those charity bracelets or something but do you think I can find one oh, there's another nice view of the Queen Victoria building 
the sun beating down on it. Let's get into this tourist store. This might have something. Uh, so that was a massive fail. They only had uh, crocodile skin bracelets that um, had big crocodile teeth on them. Not real keen on that. Down on the corner of uh, George and Market Street here, I might as well tell you what the uh, we weather observations are today, this Friday morning. It's going to be 27 degrees Celsius in Sydney, uh, which is about 80 Fahrenheit, right? So it's going to be quite a warm day. Um, unfortunately for me, I'm going to be indoors um, for part of it. But then later in the day, I'll be coming out to to slurp on some drinks, hopefully. Maybe General Pants has got something. Let's go and have a look. Go down the escalator. All right, Maya was a fail as well. So let's keep walking. I tell you what, I'm absolutely stinging for a nectar, so hopefully we'll get down there soon and grab one of those. Jeez, that's loud music. on George Street still doesn't know where to go just waiting in Macca's getting a sausage egg muffin put some lining in the stomach because I'm gonna be drinking a bit later for you uh, Americans that might be listening watching this when you come to Oz get yourself a sausage and egg muffin 149 I was saying, if you come to Oz, get yourself a sausage and egg muffin. Our sausage and egg muffins are delightful. That actually taste like real sausage, but your ones taste like synthetic. Now I've got to quickly walk this down somewhere. So, see if, see if we can find a spot to put the camera down. Put it on these seats over here. That'll do. successful mission sausage and egg muffin is lining my stomach it's 
going past the Apple store. Oh, look, there's the garbage bin. Get rid of this refuse. Back over the tram tracks. Good timing. The guy looks like him. Still a few people milling around, still getting into the office on George Street. Just after 10.30 a.m. now. I apologise in advance. I'll probably be having it a, ne a nectar at a a place that we've already visited before which is uh, the Dutch smuggler down at Circular Quay but that's where I've got to meet one of my colleagues before we head off to the event that we've got to go to these people over here are doing a tour of the city got a tour guy with them Sadie's going to give us a little concert as we go past. Here she goes. She's going to keep going. Talk a bit over the top of her. There's a couple of workmen down here. How are we? Yeah, good, thank you. Working on the telephone lines, probably. going on up here there's a big queue outside this joint she's got some volume on her speakers yeah, what's going on here look at this some place called song for the mute Must have some uh, special merchandise in there today. Just going past Bar Toddy's. No one's sitting in here yet, but there'll be a bunch of people there for lunch. Get through the crowd here. It's that coffee stand again. Been past there before. Uh, all the punters lining up for their cafe injection. Caffeine, I should say. This building. Above Wynyard Station. There goes the uh, special police, the riot squad. Wonder what they're doing in the city. There must be going to be a protest today. You see that? You see that van show up, or that SUV show up? And you know there's going to be a bit of trouble. Oh, 
is Hunter Street still closed off as they redevelop the Hunter Street connection just here see look I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in a previous video this street furniture that they got on George Street now look how dirty and filthy it is now look cigarettes stuck in the in the holes I knew they were going to be a, a waste of time you're going to have to build it of a different material I think look at all the punters in the sun there waiting for their morning nectar look got me stinging for one now Girl had second thoughts about getting in the camera shot then. Thank goodness. Didn't want to have to move out of the way. Getting close at a circular key now. Just passing over Bond Street. Being a Friday, there's plenty of tourists around. There goes the big bus in the distance. This annoys me when you come out of Abercrombie Lane here and you film this way the sign says Bridge Street but it's not Bridge Street oh look there's people hanging outside the Grumpy Baker down there look got their nectars down there probably some baked goods but yeah you come out and you see Bridge Street you go Bridge Street what they say Bridge Street it says George Street it's just they've built the tram station right on the corner of Bridge Street so they've named the tram stop Bridge Street I don't see the point in it I reckon they should have just called it something else maybe they should have called it um, George Street North or something Just quick to take, a, to take a quick film here. Uh, Jimmy look up towards York Street up there a couple of the obligatory renter bikes you see scattered around all the major cities of the world this guy's taking a photo of garbage bin it's interesting Morrison Hotel over there back in the days that used to be a real hangout for the traders on the Australian Stock Exchange floor they used to get in there maybe they still do I don't know where their office is now I don't know whether it's still where the ASX is or whether they've moved or working remotely I don't know some place called the Avenue oh the Avenue is serving up nectars as well oh, let's have a look what it looks like it's not where I'm going though I'm going to that um... oh yeah 
Yeah, it looks alright. Bit noisy and a bit. A lot of corporate types in there. getting closer now I can smell the coffee beans uh, last time we came through the through here these construction boards went up I can see oh can't see my mate anywhere there he may have moved to a new location let me ring him and find out. Changed my mind. I don't think I will have a nectar here. I think I might go back to the avenue when my mate arrives. Because I don't fancy having a hot coffee in the sun here. A bit too warm I reckon. Look at these buildings here. Where is this clown? He said he was upstairs. I still don't see him. I'll see you in a sec when I get into the avenue. Alright, here we are at Avenue on George. But it's too hot at that other one in the sun. So we've stopped here to have the nectar. There's some delicious pastries and sandwiches in the window here to have with your coffee. Some obligatory banana breads and blueberry breads here. There's a delightful Italian coffee machine there. Beans at the ready. So yeah, let's wait for the uh, coffee to arrive. So here we are. Seated at the avenue waiting for the nectar to arrive. This is a nice outlook actually. You can see out to George Street there. There's a nice a bit of a little light breeze coming through this tunnel here. So quite a pleasant place to have a drop. Oh here we are. The flat wide has arrived. <laughs> oh look at that. I see a little bit of a crema in the in the top there as well. A few bubbles around. What did you get? What's this? It's just a latte. A latte. All right. Let me consume this on George Street in the Avenue, and uh, I'll see you again when I can. Thought I'd film having the nectar for you. at the avenue yeah all right a bit bitter but that may be because i got a large one yeah good enough see you soon all right guys gonna do a bit of a tourist thing so on my way up into the rocks spring in city the jacaranda trees are out got all the punters getting photos just step out of this person's photo here there's a cruise ship in town look at the jacarandas delightful what's it called it's called the pacific adventure that cruise ship over there Hunters getting their photos next to the jacaranda tree. A few people. Oh, geez, there's someone reading a book. Didn't think that happened anymore. Oh, look, there's a magpie. There you go. I tried to capture one of those the other day.
that's a good shot of the jacaranda there look beautiful spring day in Sydney circular key in the rocks I was going to end the vid up here in a sec, but I've changed my mind. I might uh, whack it back on when I hit the drinking hole later. Get some cheeky cocktails out. Yeah, so um, I, I saw the video. Yeah. Now, where did my colleague go? He's disappeared. The tourists out enjoying a coffee over here, look. Like. Where's he gone? Ah, I found him. So let's let's keep the camera going as we walk through the rocks. Old police station there, look. Looks like it's a restaurant now. Called Sergeant Lock. Bar and dining. The British lolly shop been passed there before. Oh, let's head up the Suez Canal. Head up the other direction. Last time we walked down. Tourists picking up billabong hats in there and flip flops, thongs. Okay. I'll have a look over the weekend. Pretty keen, pretty keen dragging those through there. <laughs> yeah, all right. Hey, hey. Hey. Here we go up the Suez Canal. Can smell some delight in the air. Let's see this restaurant here. I'm getting pretty close to my destination now so get ready to snap the camera off here in Harrington Street but I'll, I'll join you later for a, a drink or two so hang around <laughs> so we finished our little exercise in the rocks and now we're in the rooftop bar at the Glenmore here's my cheeky little beer we've got lunch after this so I'm just having a quick one here Here's the rooftop bar. Try to avoid snapping the people I'm with. There's a view over the city and the harbour from this rooftop bar here. The rocks down there. There's that big P&O cruise liner waiting in Circular Quay. Nice breeze blowing. Drinks going down way too easy. I've got a feeling we might be going to the Argyle for lunch. So, whack the film back on there.
let me film on the way out and see if I can get a shot of the opera house. Oh look, it's empty now. No one's here. Oh no, you can't see it because the cruise ship's there. So behind, oh you can see the sails on top there. For the ships there. Silly HW. Right, on to the next joint. So totally balls it up. We won't go into the Argyle for lunch. We're coming to the uh, Munich Beer House. So we've got the beers lined up here. Got one here. Here's the menu for the Munich Beer House. I think we're going to bring out some pretzels in a minute. Get stuck into those. So I'll whack the camera back on once we uh, once we uh, get the food. So we're having a bit of an Oktoberfest lunch. Never actually been in here. Oh, finally finally something to eat oh, I was about to pass out here the pretzels have arrived oh yum this is so badly so badly are you glad the pretzels have arrived yes oh yum <laughs> Oh, there it is, the Munich Bear House. Oh, I just said bear, didn't I? What is it? Brow House, I should have said. But yeah, I'm glad that's over. Um, whole bunch of, uh, you know, German fare, pork knuckle and sausages and all the rest of it, so I've had enough. See you in the next joint. Oh, here we are. We're on top of Ho Hotel Palisade in the Henry Dean's rooftop bar. Walked past here a few times on the vid. So here we are, I'll prove it to you. So look, we've got this delightful area out here. Let's get a view over this side of the city first. Gotta watch my hat doesn't blow off, it's quite windy up here. There's Barangaroo. Still a fair bit of it under construction. The tower that holds the Crown Casino. There's a view of one part of the city. Just walked over from the rocks from that Munich beer house or bra house or whatever it's called. There's a few people having a cheeky drink down here on this terrace and then down on the ground level. So yeah. Waiting for the cocktails to arrive. There's a train going over the harbour bridge there. You can see the yellow markings on the door and the engines. Ferry crosses over the harbour. Just holding on to my hat, it's blowing a gale. There's North Sydney over there. Milsons Point. Oh look, there's a guy on rollerblades down there. I thought rollerblades were extinct, but uh, obviously not. So yeah, let me go and have a look at the menu and pick a cocktail out. It's going to be a great place to end of the day anyway. Oh, here we are. We've got the cocktail menu open. Let's have a look here. Between $17 and $25, people. We've got a mini martini, fizzy wine, John Lemon. Stay Golden, Gay, Fuzzy Peach, Below the Belt, Smooth Criminal, ah, oh, there it goes there, that shows you how windy it is, Go Slow Man, Old Salty Girl, Coffee Culture and Hot Toddy, let me see what I'm going to grab here, Ooh. It's got to be something with vodka in it. HW likes his vodka. John 
some lemons looking all right it's got some native uh, flora in it it's got some lemon myrtle there's also that mini martini up the top as well it's got some vodka and kakadu plum in it so they got the real Australian native theme going oh here we go the John Lemon has arrived oh what a delight beautiful lemon sorbet in it or the Aussie lemon myrtle sorbet delicious could have another sip oh that's a treat so Actually, you know what? I'll keep the camera rolling and I'll film on the way out so you can see what this delightful little hotel looks like. All right, we're finished in Henry Dean. As promised, I'll walk out of this delightful rooftop bar and show you what it looks like. It's a view out the window to Barangaroo. It's another bar over there. The different bars all over the joint. How do we get out over here? Here we go. Oh, out of the elevator, down here. All right, I'm heading to another venue, so I might as well keep rolling. Oh, here we are. We've made it into the new hotel, the W Hotel. Here we are, sitting up at the bar like Jackie. I've got myself a um, some sort of concoction here, cocktail. I swapped out the tequila for vodka so yeah nice little bar there's some private rooms up up that staircase there we declined it because we're just going to have a couple of drinks here but the swimming pool's just through there I'll do a bit of a film as we come out all right we're finished in the W hotel here's the foyer down here and they've got a couple of courtesy cars we're gonna walk up to the station now I had way too many cocktails in the W Hotel let me tell you if you make it over to the W Hotel I recommend you have the yellow 50 cocktail that was a delight and also ask the barman for a, an east side or a south side they're both delights as well So I thought I'd finish up by walking along Cockle Bay here and we'll see the people chowing down on their dinner and then we'll finish up just at the top of that Piermont Bridge up there and I'll say goodbye to you up there. Hello? Hello? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, I'll do it now. I, and tell my mum I'm coming home now. All right, see ya. Looks like there's a few few school kids around having their end of year formal. For you over in America, that's the equivalent of the prom. There's a look into Cockle Bay. 
some of the school kids there dressed up getting ready for their formal probably got a function center up above the cockle bay somewhere few of the few of the boaties on the dock here got their boats parked up they come onto Cockle Bay and have some din dins before they jump aboard the boat and head home. <laughs> yeah. oh, let's go up the other escalators. I was going to go up there, but I'll head down the other ones over here. Head up the other ones. a few more school formal kids here we go up the escalator there's all the tourist traps over there, wildlife, sea, sea life. Bit of a sunset in the background as we look over Darling Harbour and the W Hotel in the distance there where just put down quite a few number of cocktails. Thank you for coming a little skirt around the city today and a few different venues for drinks and lunch. Like, comment, subscribe. I, no I notice a number of you um, who do visit the channel don't bother subscribing. It would really help if you subscribed well I never expect to have any great numbers of subscribers it'd be nice to get up to the 1k mark anyway just from an from a personal target point of view so yeah enjoy your weekend wherever you are in the world and I'll see you in the next vid the video is over